Hello, my name is Serge Kate. I'm going to show you how to do a full restoration on an old arcade cabinet. First I'm going to strip off all the parts of this 1981 cabinet to see what's the damage. So, the cabinet is all stripped and now we can have a better look at what needs to be fixed. As you can see there is a big crack here, a big crack here in the wood. There is one here that needs to be fixed and I think the biggest problem I found is this. Look at this corner and at this corner. You see the whole top is broken off. First thing I will do now is to repair the cracked wood. Make sure the cracks are clean, then put some um, wood glue in it. Just push it, rub it in real good. Then clean it off a bit. And then um, push it in and take out uh, the rest of the glue, clean it off again. Then uh, put some wood with a clamp on it, make sure it's really tight. So that's done. Um, I leave it for 24 hours to dry. And now I'm going to uh, measure with this piece of wood the angle of the corner to repair it. This is the exact corner piece we're missing. Katja! Now I'm going to paint it black, tack it on and after it I have to do some plastering. I have sanded the corners so the plaster will take better and also removed uh, the T-molding which wasn't already. So I also have to uh, repair this. The glue needs to dry, so in the meantime I'm going to rip everything off from the inside that I don't need. Before you start ripping out everything, think carefully what you can use uh, later on, so you don't destroy things uh, that you need. And when you're finished, just wash it up with some water and soap. By cleaning up the cabinet I found out that one wheel was totally broken off. So I have to replace it. The problem is that uh, the wheels we know, they have a different frame and uh, it won't fit in. So I have to drill out the wheel screw and uh, replace it to the other one. Here is the coin door. There is a lot of rust in it. I will uh, clean it a bit up, not spray it over. The inside, there are still some original lights in it. I will try later on to get them working again. The lock door is cleaned, all the rust is off, new locks in it. The safe door uh, had a spray over. The cabinet has a new set of wheels. The corner is plastered. Um, it's now time to uh, make it all smooth and spray it. The corner is sprayed and fixed and now it's time to uh, put some new uh, T-molding on it. But uh, the original T-molding is, uh, you can't get it anymore. So I decided to uh, use this uh, type of molding, one that you iron on. There's some clue on the back. 
and then it uh, will stay on it and uh, it will do. Thanks for watching, watch part 2 to see the next steps.